uh, would say congenital malformation, somebody who is born with abnormality within the genitalia, where you cannot determine whether it's a male or a female. And uh, th this, is, this happens. And when we say hypospadias or epispadias, it is depending on the position of the urethra. And those operations, of this for ammonia, who is not paying attention. And when we say we are, we are doing the, those operations in terms of occitopexy, you, uh, we, in, in Tanzania they say teramusha kende, you, 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 operation teramusha kende. You're bringing it down because it's up there. So these are from the socket downwards. So I, I think you get it now there. We get it, honorable member, for, <laughs> <laughs> honorable member for Endebes. And I think that was for honorable Manyo. I hope you can get the answer if you didn't hear everything so that you can refer to for your explanation. Um, follow up question by Honorable Umi. Thank you, Madam Speaker. Uh, in the same breath of NHIF cover for vulnerable people, I also wanted to ask the Cabinet Secretary what the, the benefits for persons with invisible disability like autism, uh, dyslexia, and uh, ADHD because the cost of therapy is very high. Thank you. Thank you. That is very quick and precise. Member for Funula. I also just wanted to follow up on the same issue, whether NHIF cover also covers matters related to treatment for inability to bear children, both male and women. Honorable Gekaria, I want to, you to be the last one. Honorable CS, I hope you have the issue by Honorable Funula, whether infertility is covered. Honorable Gekaria, one minute. Actually, it will be even less. Honorable Speaker, thank you. It's just to ask, in, in law, we have alternative dispute resolution where you can get other means. Is you talking out to that person not to have an operation and just remain the way they were born an alternative? Thank you, Honorable Speaker. CS, kindly respond. Thank you, Madam Speaker and Honorable Members. In terms of benefits at the NHIF for persons with invisible uh, disabilities, uh, which uh, the Honorable Member has uh, cited uh, autism and uh, others, we have a guideline at the ministry and uh, all the benefits